All right, we're going to make a movie on showing how to uh, add a Victor Airway or a Jet Route Airway into uh, the Garmin 650. So we're pretty much right here on our home screen uh, for our map. Now let's just go, uh, we can go ahead and uh, enter in our flight plan. So follow along. Home. Brings us up to uh, our flight plan page. Add that. Add our start point. We'll start with Janesville, the airport. So K, J, V, L. Can enter that. Now we'll add our clearance was uh, Janesville, uh, the airport. Join Victor 97 to Crenna, Northbrook Direct. So we're going to add Janesville to VOR. Okay. Now from here we can add Victor 97. It will load all the points and uh, fill this in really quickly for us. All we have to do is highlight. Uh, the VOR, or the point that uh, we're going to join the airway. Now right here it says load airway. I'm going to click that. Now all these different airways pop up off of the Janesville VOR, like Victor 128, Victor 24, Victor 9, Victor 63. At the bottom, if you scroll all the way down, you see Victor 97. So we'll go ahead and add that. Now these are all the different possible uh, points that we can access off of Victor 97 from the, the VOR. So we can go to the Bulls intersection, uh, go for VOR near Minneapolis, but our clearance was to Crenna. So we can add Crenna, tap that. So we have entry point, Jamesville VOR, we're going to fly Victor 97, and then exit Victor 97 at the Crenna intersection. We can preview it. So there's the route, and then we can sit, and here's all the, the fixes that we're going to fly over between Janesville VOR and Crenna, Lowson, Trio, Bulls, Teddy, and Crenna. We can load it. All of our points are now added into our flight plan, and then simply we just have to add OBK for Northbrook. OK. And then add... Pelwaki for direct. Oops. P W K. There we have it. Janesville, Victor 97, North uh, Crenna, Northbrook Direct. That's it.